Sami people of northern Scandinavia, it's time you had your own nation. So we are back on Hearts of Iron 4 today and we are going after the trophy Sap Me United by the Fire. So as Sami own and control every Sami core. So that is what we are going for today. So we need to start off as Sweden. We are going to disband the whole army because that is precious manpower we need. And then we are going to release Sap Me. Play as. So here we have a nice yellow colour. We are Sap Me. I know someone moaned at me for saying yellow is a nice colour, is it? But I like it. So look at this. We have the Sami Council. Look at them. Look how cool they look. Is there a better leader portrait in the game? I think not. Unfortunately, we don't have a focus tree. It's just a generic one. So we will start off going political effort for 70 days. We've got two research slots. We'll go for productivity and we'll go down electrical engineering for this research speed and then we will kick off so we've got one sieve so we will start building another we have no mills we have barely any manpower but we do have a lot of resource we've got quite a bit of steel chromium and tungsten so uh, steel is nice so that will be good we'll be needing that political effort done we will go down collectivist ethos and we will go towards the fascist path obviously because we are going to need some conquering so we will get the fascist demagogue with our first bit of political power with that one done so we're going to go down nationalized focus militarism to get to the extra manpower because we will be needing that ticking over then we'll do industrial effort down the sieves and then pick up the mills as well that's the path we're going so we obviously want to flip fascists as soon as possible, so we'll open that up. We want the manpower to continue ticking up, we never want it to be not mobilising. So I've got to keep on track of that because we are going to need the manpower and we do not have any. Right, militarism done, so we get some more manpower and we will go down industrial. Norway is going to be our first target, I think they've got a navy which we want. And I think we should be able to do it. We've got a large border, so hopefully we can do a bit of surrounding and the supply is going to be poor. The fascist ticking up. We will hit discredit government. Need another 10%. More research. Let's get the improved. And we'll get the radio as well. Still ticking up. 45%. Fascist Assault Division, perfect, that will take us over, that's handy. Fascist Demand Referendum, perfect, and then we will jump, uh, is our man, yeah, manpower still ticking, so we'll go for War Economy straight away. We'll take use of the new ones, we'll have some guns off Finland, please, thank you. And then we'll take some artillery off the Germans, we're going to be buying a lot, because we can't make too much. So let's pump out some divisions to begin with, some infantry, let's see if we can get six of them out I think, and then some cavalry as well for circling. We'll go for support weapons one and we'll use the new designers as well. And then we will start just to find on Norway, 110 days and it's a core state so we can keep that war goal. First four out, I bet, oh we don't have any field commanders. Oh we do, look at these nice portrait though for the generals, that's good, we'll take you, thank you both pretty poor. Right we've got six, the plan is I'm going to put four there and then we're going to put two up here. I'm going to try and close off the gap with these and then use the cavalry to take the bit in between because that is all core territory. We'll go for military youth as well while we pump out these cavalry because we need some manpower. Justification is done. We're not going to declare on them yet but we are going to buy some more guns. Thank you Hungry, we will take uh, cut for a thousand, we'll have 800 off you. One delivery. Yes, thank you. Bye bye, your guns. We're just getting the last cavalry out. Military youth, so we get some more manpower. And let's go for industrial effort, I think. There we go, last one. One more. And now I think we are ready. So we've got all the cavalry in between. We're going to close the pocket. So what have they got? Probably about the same amount of troops, maybe a couple more. Just before we will buy some more guns, thank you. And now we will go for Norway. So quickly move our men there, see if I can take the port. 
move you and we'll get a little bottleneck. Can't push here with the other two, which is a shame, but we'll just hold them there. I want them to push out a little bit and then we can encircle them with our cavalry. So as soon as we've taken there, so we've got a nice little one. But they can hold two units and we'll use two more here to push out and start surrounding. Using our cavalry just to walk in any open space, start surrounding them and uh, ruining their org and their supply. Move out here, we'll take that victory point. Any spaces, we'll try and encircle and de -org. You can move there, couple there, cavalry, quick cavalry. These are only like four whip cavalry as well. Stop pushing, I don't know why you're doing that. We're just holding there. Move back so we don't get encircled. Oh, he did get encircled, but we will do a Uno reverse encirclement. We'll get a few more infantry units out for closing of pockets. Now we've got some manpower because we've taken back these. These are all cores. He's abandoned there, Norway have, so we will close the pocket and take the port as well. Thank you very much. More encirclement. Cavalry doing all the heavy lifting. We will take that other port, yeah. Perfect. I think we own all the ports now, so these are all surrounded. We'll just lock him there. Another encirclement. He can stay there. Got our new units ready to go, so we'll use them to close this pocket here. Let's add a bit of artillery as well to our infantry and our cavalry so they get a bit of bite to them. So we can start finally closing these pockets a bit. Walked out that port, we'll have that as well, thank you. Let's just leave him there. Right, large. First pocket, sorry, we are closing. Italian send military support, thank you very much. We do need that equipment. Got another couple of units waiting in training. Just start closing some of these pockets. He's got a nice encirclement there. Move the cavalry into these ones and we'll circle all of these. Thank you. Right, last couple of pockets we are just crushing with our infantry and cavalry. One more gone. Last one here. They're just randomly attacking that port. Ain't going to break that one, so we're all good. Right, time to push down in the south now. So he's weak here, so we'll move in and go this way. Try and then circle these ones, push round them, and then we'll just snake for the victory points. Let's go get another research slot as well, get more than two. Still on the industry stuff we're building up. Close those little two, close that pocket. Now we've got some space, we will shove our cavalry in quickly. Stop pinning, yeah, another encirclement, and then we'll just snake through and this will be game over for Norway. Push into Oslo and that should be it, is it? Might need one more place. No, that's it. Wait till midnight and there we go. Capitulation, thank you for the guns as well, thank you. And civilian trains, we'll be needing that. So we've taken all of Norway, I couldn't be bothered to pop it, I thought I'd have it all. And we've also taken their navy as well, which we will be needing. And I'll go and get transport ships because I always forget about that. And then we will get six more units, so we've got tw uh, 20 infantry now ready for our invasion of the UK. They are next in the target, we will join the Axis and we will join the war. So we will, we're only at 8 width, almost manpower's done. So we will get some more infantry and then when I can I will go and get an artillery in there as well. Finland's joined the Allies, that's good actually because they're in the peace deal now. I was going to have to take them on separately or I was going to declare war on them so they join the Allies, but fine. For some reason on historical they've joined the Allies. So we will set up our invasion ready for the UK. We're going to hit Edinburgh and Newcastle there. We'll get our new little navy to do strike force so we get naval supremacy. I hope for a split second and then our troops can go. The Axis doing Axis things in Africa, I see. Russia's crushing Finland for us, and I'm not going to guard the border, but the Germans are doing it for me anyway. So just waiting for a bit more equipment and our manpower to go up a bit. I want to be strong before we go in for it. 
Right, time to join the war. War done. Hopefully we will go... Yeah, naval invasion straight off. Perfect. We'll decline that. Let's go and land. Landed nice in Edinburgh. Don't think we're going to be able to take Newcastle here. They had guards on it and they seem to be stronger than us. So we will quickly build a naval base here and hopefully I can hold it for sort of 30 days while that builds so we'll push out and get a couple of lines hopefully right I think we are okay if we can just hold this for a couple more weeks the naval base should be built and then we can bring the rest in alright naval base built let's dump our units down here we'll use those three seem to be holding up north I might quickly build a little fort each, just to give it a bit more kick. Let's see if we can push down. I don't think we can. Our units are so poor. I need the Germans to do a bit of heavy lifting for us, but relying on the AI always works well, doesn't it? I'd circle all in the middle. I might be able to do it. If I add another artillery for a bit more bite. I just don't have the manpower to include the increase the infantry, unfortunately. Equipment's all right. Just need a bit more artillery now. Right, I can't really get anywhere. The Germans aren't pushing, so I'm going to do a cheeky little naval invasion to Hull to hopefully draw them away. The Germans have pushed up and taken Scotland though, which is good. Right, naval invasion went off. We've joined lines. They've got a bit of gap, so we're going to push down quickly before they can relocate. Hopefully, the Germans fill in as well. Aim of the game is keep moving so they deorg and move themselves. Some more equipment from Italy, thank you. We are lacking a bit now. Ally, there's Greece. We've got first little encirclement, so there's a couple of troops we can quickly kill and take out. Push around Liverpool as well, a few more encirclements. They can pour troops in if they like. We will take them out. Pocket in Liverpool being closed nicely. Slowly pushing our way down with a bit of German Panzer divisions helping us. Just outside of London, come on. Still got a bit of time before the Americans join, which obviously we need to get the Allies done before then. Can't really push, I think. Now I'm being pushed back a bit here, getting circled. Circled them round Cardiff, pushing there. This isn't going exactly to plan. I don't know where the Germans have gone, they've all disappeared. I'm sort of holding, but they are pushing back a couple of tiles. I forget that the new buying system, I can still ask for Lenly, so we'll just take all of that for free from the Germans. Thank you very much. Right, plan. I can't go anywhere. So let's try, if I give them all the territory, I know I'll lose some score from this. A, I don't then need the manpower to guard it. And B, I'm hoping the Germans will pump some troops in because it's now theirs. That's the plan. Plan worked. The Germans are filled in, but they're not pushing. So we will go for another cheeky naval invasion down to Dover and see if we can quickly grab London or at least take some of their troops out. So naval invasion done. Landed nicely in Dover and killed the port guard. Can we push for London? couple of tanks but we have got a bit of anti-air which has got piercing no the Yuka's library has got about six divisions on there naval invasion I wasn't paying attention to but hopefully the Germans will do that because I haven't got the power we're just holding down in Dover having to pull out now unfortunately let's pull out before they get encircled I really need some German power They've done the encirclement, they've cleaned that up, which is nice. The uh, naval invasion, sorry. I really need... The Germans so easily could push. I'm going to do another naval invasion, but in the meantime, it looks like the Germans are pushing. Oh, if they can capitulate for all... Oh, go on, Germany. The AI is actually doing something. Come on. Come on, keep pushing. Come on, just take London. The Germans are actually doing it. They're doing it. I've never... Yes! I've never cheered on the Germans invading England before. All of London. Right, we can now take what we need from the peace deal. So we just need a few bits in Finland, I believe. Take those ones, thank you. Ended up taking all of Finland, might as well. Let's have a bit of a bigger. And then we just need Murmansk now from the Russians. So we will set up our border. Not going to be able to do a lot here, but the 
Axis sort of controls everything, so hopefully they can destroy the Soviets because no one's coming to help them. But this is a lot relying on the AI. Just going to build a couple of supply depots, I think. One there, one there, and we'll use the reorganizer railway for 300%. Ease it up on conscription, but I will join the war before that comes. Right, so we joined the war, what are we in? 1941 October. Hopefully we can push the Germans out up here and get the manpower. Got a nice fleet as well from the Royal from the uh, Peace Deal, so we will use that to come hunting for some Russian ships in This is now has this always been three different seas? I think they've changed that. I never remember it being this Gulf of Finland here. I thought this was all just like the North Sea or something. It might have even been one. I don't remember it being this. Can't remember. I'll have to go back and look now. So I'm trying to push them out with my Manx. I can't because they seem to be so strong and we are losing a lot. Little encirclement here. I'm doing a bit of convoy raiding in the sea so hopefully they will just lose all their supply. Germany is sort of smashing through the Russian. They are melting a bit, which is good. We're still struggling up here in the north. This is meant to be core territory. Come on, the Sami people. Right, there, we've taken the port at least. A couple of navies destroyed as well. Our Sami navy is doing bits. Should just be able to clean up these last couple of pockets here now. They've got no supply at all. Perfecto. In, uh, equipment's looking good. Strikes, yeah, just what I needed, thanks a lot. How can you strike? We've just claimed all the territory back. Germans are having problems, so we will do them hands and build them a couple of supply depots. I don't think you get another one of those. No, reorgers, do you? Let's just close these couple of pockets. Get ourselves some enough war score so at least we can take some territory back. I can't really do anything now so we will help out by building some more supply depots because the Germans don't want to do it. We'll also set up some collaboration governments as well to try and get that uh, score down. Supply depots being built, April again. We are going to take Stalingrad, that's our big thing in the Russian war. The Sami people will take, uh, they're losing lives because I've run out of org. Come on, take Stalingrad, screw it. Force attack, come on. Yes. German spear, that's, that is disrespectful to the Sami people. I've only got two units left. We've lost so many units trying to take Stalingrad, but we did it. 2,000 men, that's all we have left. That's worthless, isn't it? I might as well just delete this. We are now just observing the Germans. We're going to have to help them out again. We'll just, more supply and more collaboration governments that's what we'll do the Sami people <laughs> are fighting no more we have no men just a bit of a navy doing bits and we'll supply 99% they've been on this for about six months now will the Germans just please take a victory point I've been sat for ages just spectating now and they are doing nothing couple of victory point look at these just push for them all right I've had to Pull out a couple of units and we are going to take one and that should be it. The Sami people have to finish it off as well. I think that's it. But we're saving. Is that the full? Is that it? Come on, that's got to be the only... Yes, there we go. Peace. We will take our one core, thank you. And that should mean... There we go, popped off. Sampi united by the fire, there we go. We did absolutely nothing really in the Russian war apart from the final punch. But here we have it. The Great East Sami Realm. All our cores. We've got a little bit of Finland as well and a bit of Norway that we don't really need. There we go. Sampi by the fire completed. Another trophy off the achievement off the list. So please uh, put a thumbs up if you like this video. Comment anything you want to see in the future. And uh, thanks for watching.